Hey guys, when Apple first demonstrated their Face ID, we all know that they failed the first time. Now, Apple has explained this issue that they had a problem with the setup and most likely that the iPhone rebooted according to multiple sources. But despite of these sources explaining the issue, there's still a ton of people who are skeptical of using Face ID. Today, I'm here to talk about several ways Face ID could be better than Touch ID. Stay tuned as we talk about that. Now we all know that everything has its own pros and cons, just like Face ID and Touch ID. Both have their flaws, but I believe Face ID has less of them. A lot of people are saying that Touch ID is more simple and intuitive when compared to Face ID. But I don't just get their point here. They say it's just a single click of your home button and it unlocks right away. Sure, that's easy, but I believe that Face ID is way quicker since you already are actually in fact looking at your phone and your phone unlocks right away. All you need to do is a swipe up which is equivalent to a single press of the home button when compared to the predecessors of the iPhone X. Another thing that I wanted to point out is that as far as I know, Touch ID can't work when your fingers are either oily, wet, or covered with cloth such as gloves. Face ID on the other hand, according to Apple, can work even though you have glasses on. This is really useful once you are in the snow during winter or when you're at the beach during summer. Apple has claimed that Face ID is way more secure than Touch ID. Now we all know that this has a 1 in a million chance that someone can unlock your phone with their face. While Touch ID on the other hand has a 1 in a 50,000 chance. And those who are afraid that someone could just grab your phone, point it at your face, and run away, you do have slight of a point here. Although I believe that Face ID, in order to work, has to be close enough for you to stop whoever grabbed your phone. Also, you do have this attention awareness which requires your eyes to look at the phone when unlocking it. Also, for the Android fans out there, or the Fandroids, Face ID is not some rip-off of the facial recognition feature on a lot of Android devices. This is a far more advanced technology which requires a 3D image of your face together with your irises in order to unlock it. This can't be fooled with just some mask or even some 2D image, unlike most Android phones out there. This is why they use their iris scanner together with a dot projector and their 3D camera to detect the 3D image of your face. And by the way, you can also fool Touch ID using some sort of clay and you put it on the fingerprint of the owner and it could unlock it easily. This is why I believe that Face ID is far more superior when compared to these other options. If you're complaining that Face ID is kind of difficult since you will have to hold your phone at a certain angle, you are kind of wrong here. This is one of the reasons why Apple uses 3D facial recognition for it to be unlocked at other certain angles. This is one of the reasons why Apple used 3D facial recognition in order for you to unlock your phone at other angles and basically make it more simple and easier for the end user experience. Now before this turns into a rant, I just want to explain why Face ID is far more superior to these other technologies. And if you call me triggered, sure I am but not because this is Apple but because other people are not seeing the full potential of this technology and are just immediately hating on it. You guys wanted Apple to change? Here they are, changing Touch ID into Face ID. Now that's about it. If you like this video, you know how the like button works, and if you didn't, go ahead and dislike it. It would be great if you could subscribe though. Hey guys, thanks for watching my video. It would be great if you could follow me on Facebook, SoundCloud, and Twitter, as well as subscribing to my channel on YouTube. Once again, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.